Hi friends, how are you? So this is Tech Dog and here I have Android 14 and Android 13, Pixel 7 Pro and Pixel 6 Pro. So let's talk about new things in both devices. This is a side to side comparison and it is an in depth comparison between Android 13 and Android 14. First of all, let's talk about UI. Okay. If we click on anywhere, like if we click on anywhere, you can see the UI. Right now, it's the same. Uh, this one is at Android. 14 and this one is at Android 13. If we go to the wallpapers, right, you can check the speed. Uh, the Android 14 speed has been increased a little bit. If we talk about the lock screen, if we go to the lock screen here, you can see the very new customization in the Android 14. As you can see here, uh, Android 13 has a simple and very unique and very minimalistic view. But at Android 14, you can see some shortcuts. In this shortcuts, you can customize your lock screen too. If we go to the lock screen, just for example, if we go to the lock screen, if you press on hold that, you can see the customized lock screen. You can click on that and then it will detect your face and lock and it will go to the lock screen. Okay, and there is no option like that. If we close that phone, okay, and press and hold that, nothing happening. As you can see, wallpaper has more, more dynamics. You can see side to side comparison. The, the pixels or in the Android have done a very good job. You can see, you can customize the wallpaper, right? Or you can set up the wallpaper. Also, if you cannot see the good colors, I'm sorry for that because of the lighting condition. I'm in the, my office right now and I have to make this video. You can customize the lock screen just like that. Okay, uh, my favorite one is this one. I can preview that and it will be get bigger. You can make it smaller. We can make it customizable. For example, the size, you can make it a small, small size, right? And also you can make it big size as dynamic. Okay. And if we want to change these icons, if I click on that, you can see those icons in, in the bottom of the screen. See that this is a shortcut and you can change them. How you can change them? You can go to the down section. There's a shortcuts, right? Click on that. And if you click on that, there is more options. But I hope so that Android 14 a new updates will bring the application shortcuts. Whenever like you want to choose the application, a single application, you can do that. That will be very, very benefit. So you can change the left shortcut, you can change the right, right shortcut. But in this scenario, you can only change the wallpaper. This is my cousin. And if we go to the live room, you can change the live room and stuff like that. Sorry, my health is down right now, but I have to make this video. I hope you will like, subscribe and make sure to share this video with others. If we see, uh, there is an app grid option and team icon option. You cannot see here because it's in the lock screen. If you go to the home screen, you can see these options, theme icon and uh, dark theme, right? So, yeah, I have the 5.5 grid on Pixel 6 Pro and 4.5 grid on Pixel 7 Pro. Some some functions are not in the Pixel 6 Pro but are in the Pixel 7 Pro. If you see the wallpaper, the wallpaper is dynamic. If I go to the lock screen, right, and I have already changed the wallpaper. But if you go to the lock screen, see that it is dynamically appearing. And this is very good in the Android 14, right? So, this is... I think so all for the lock screen also there is more changes like open settings right if we go back you can see a different side to side difference that there is the there is the uh, changes it is bold and it is color and it is not bold and it is not colored this is the ui and you can see how it is uh, appearing and this is the ui how it is appearing these small changes are so good in android 14 too if we click on the android 14 uh, this is the easter egg and there is a very good haptic basically they have it has so much haptic in android 14 if we press and hold that uh, you can see the stars has been moving and suddenly we go to the game okay this is not a kind of game you can see this is a kind of like um just just interesting in android uh 14 and if we go to the android 13 for example if we go to the system and, and go to the android 13 and if we click on that android 13 and if we go to like one o'clock right it's go to this and this and that's all but it is moving and doing some very good stuff you can change it and and play with it as you want you can please as you want right so if we go back so let's go no, move to a notification panel if we go down you can see the notification panel is almost the same right if you go down you can see uh, the notification panel is almost the same. So we are in the status bar. So some of the things are changed. See Android 14, right? If I play something, both animations are the same. But, 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 if you see uh, side to side comparison, you can see that Android 14 have a little bit 
a larger display for displaying the music if we move to the setting of a pixel 6 pro this is android 13 this is android 14 this is pixel 6 pro and this is pixel 7 pro right you can see the pod ui are changed right now and so much changed that i i love i love this one if you want to move to the videos you can click on that if you want to move the video you can click on that but you have to click on that and select the uh, option you want but now you have the option to select it by uh, side by the side and a full HD and all the things are appear into this side this is always like one headed mode I don't know why they don't appear it to do like uh, do the bo uh, bottom section but they have to I wish that they can be do that in the future updates if we click on this one and uh, you can see the resolution resolution is full HD and it can, it is body like 4k 60 fps also uh, there is enhanced feature which is uh, get ready to for the 30 fps but the joy as you can see is so much changed if I go to the front camera you can see me right hey how are you you can see side to side comparison how much di how much difference in in between those camera right so there is a lot of difference this is android 14 and this is android 13 right now you will see the android 13 is really warmer right now and the android 14 is very bluish right now and it is because it ha it has a two tone on in the yeah it has the night light on so if you turn off the night light you can see the side to side comparison it's almost the same now if we go to the camera section and if you go to the camera section you can see different different options in these phones right if we scroll down there you can see these options if you go to this one and you can see these options also these are like portrait mode okay long exposure mode and the long exposure mode in air it's have different options long exposure and active pen but it have the separate separate options I think so Google should give us the opportunity to mix up these things. I'm hoping that Google will bring two UIs. Uh, the first one is this and the second one is, is this. Because some people are like this one but some people like this one. You can see the side to side comparison of these UIs. If I click on the capture, see that and if we move something, right. And Pixel is still holding, you can see. And if we click on the camera, you can see side to side comparison between uh, Pixel 6 Pro, Android 14 and this one if you go to zoom right you can see the detail it is approximately approximately equal but pixel 7 has a better result in the camera in the low light uh, i think so these are the features that i really like it and i really hope so that these features should become uh, into other smartphones uis also in the iphone just like cinematic photos and other stuff i am not including right now i'm not including the google photos options and other stuff because the video is too long too but this is the main things that uh, people want to see and this is all android 13 and android 14 i hope so you like my video thank you so much for joining next time if you like this video and give us give us so much love then i will definitely bring a new video for these comparisons thank you so much for watching i will see you next time bye